What's up YouTube? Welcome to yet another model airplanes channel video. This is going to be the fifth airport update for my model of Honolulu International Airport. No specific time frame in this update, but a couple things, a couple big things to say before I start the update. So today's shout out goes to Mile High Aviation who actually commented on one of my on my recent Honolulu airport update so i will link his channel down into the description below he even has his own replica of honolulu international airport it is quite cool and another thing before this airport update starts we actually have three new models in this update um i was trying to decide if i wanted to have two models that are new because I was trying to just, I wasn't sure, I was thinking about maybe doing a Chicago Rockford airport update and showing one of the new models there and then I'd bring this airport update after that but that obviously did not go to plan so yeah all three new models are showcased in this airport update and one of them is a charter flight that I just put in for no reason. So we'll go ahead and get started back there at the inner island terminal. So right here, we have the Hawaiian Sim 17, which is pulling out and it's gonna be going out to Hui on the island of Kauai. And right here at the terminal is the Hawaiian A321neo. And this one has just come in from a flight from I think San Diego, it's flight 15 and it's going to be heading to Long Beach, I think that's flight 70. Now you probably remember in the last update, this Hawaiian A330, there was a old livery Hawaiian A330 parked right here at this stand. Uh, yeah, as you can tell, it got repainted, so yeah, it got repainted into the new livery, really nice, and yeah, this got pulled out of the hangar, so now it's in service. Well, it will be in service soon, hopefully. We'll see. The scenario off here with the taxiway is the Japan Airlines Boeing 787-9. And this one's going out for the flight to Osaka as flight 791. And I think it came in from Tokyo Haneda, I think as flight 74. And right here we have the Hawaiian A330 in the old livery which is going to be taking the back gate right there, gate C1. And this one's just come from a flight from, I believe, Sydney as flight 451. And it'll be turning back around for a flight to Tokyo Narita. I think that's flight 863. And here we have the Air New Zealand Boeing 787-9 going out for departure flight to Auckland, New Zealand. I think that's flight 9. And back here, we have one of my new models. This is a charter flight, the Allegiant Airbus A320. And yeah, for some reason, uh, yeah, I didn't feel like doing a Chicago Rockford update. So yeah, I just decided to just put it into this update, uh, just because why not? And also, I think I've actually seen an Allegiant A320 on radar at Honolulu and actually parked near the cargo areas. So yeah, that's pretty cool that that was there. But this Allegiant A320 is going for a charter flight to Phoenix Mesa Airport, one of Allegiant's many airports that they go to. And yeah, I didn't really feel like doing a Chicago Rockford update. So yeah, here it is right here. And then behind that Hawaiian A330 in the old livery is going to be, well, it's going to be going to Malka Concourse. It has a long way to go, but it's going to be coming in. That This one's going to be going to, I think, San Diego. It's flight 16, and it came in from runway 4 right. I think from San Francisco as flight 11 and yeah like I said it's gonna be going to San Diego as flight 16 and we'll just jump back over here with the second new model we have a UPS MD11 if you can see right there the registration 
Not sure if you can see, it's November 281 Uniform Papa. So, and this aircraft is going out for a flight to, I believe, Sydney as flight 34, which is usually on a 747-400, but of course, I just felt a little lazy to put that in. So we're just gonna say that the MD-11 is doing that flight. So yeah, really cool model. And I will be having a review coming up for this plane, uh, hopefully coming in the next couple days or something, we'll see. And at the AVA concourse now, we have the Korean Air 747-400. Of course, these aren't really around anymore, so I'm just saying it's an operating for a Dash 8. Yeah, and this aircraft is gonna be wait no this just came in from seoul as flight 053 and wait no as flight zero it's gonna be heading to seoul as flight 053 and came in from there earlier as flight 054 it had to take c7 because this plane over here came in to c4 before korean air so yeah and then the next to that's the japan airlines 767-300, which is going to be going to, no, this is resting in between flights to and from Tokyo, had Tokyo Narita. I think that came in as flight 784, and it's going to be hanged back there, Tokyo Narita, later on as flight 783. And then a 821neo here from, I believe, Phoenix as flight 694, I think, yeah. Alright, American 777-200 here, taking the spot of the usual Korean Air, although K Korean Air usually park at either C7 or C6 anyways, yeah. But nonetheless, this 777 by American is coming from, actually you probably know, but I'll just say it, Dallas, as F Dallas DFW as flight 123, yeah, like pulled in like, I think five minutes ago. And then right here is the ANA 787-9 to Tokyo Haneda is flight 185. And finally for this concourse is the Hawaiian A330 in the new livery. This is going to be going to Los Angeles, I think, as flight 2 or something like that. Yeah, I think it's flight 2. Alright, central concourse right here, we'll start with the Southwest 77-800 which is getting ready to push back actually for, I think, Sacramento. Yeah. And then another 737-800 here to going, right now this one's just come in from, I believe, Hilo on the Big Island. And we'll be going back for another inner island flight, but to Kahului this time. And then, get a better view of this, 737 Max 8 which is just coming from, I believe it came from San Jose, I think, yeah, Jose. Another 737-800. Uh, this one is gonna be going to, I believe, Long Beach, and it came in from San Diego, California, yeah. And then 777-300ER here for Japan Airlines which is at E8 today. I don't know why. Um, well, actually, yeah, I think I know why, but that, that's a whole nother story. But yeah, this one's just come in from, oh no, this one, this one's gonna be heading to Tokyo Haneda as flight 71, and it came in from there earlier as flight 72. And speaking of the Haneda flight and the JL 777-300s, there is actually one time where JL, or I think a few times where the JL 777-300 has came for that, for the Tokyo Haneda flight that goes out as flight 73 at around 12 something. So yeah, that's just some news for you. All right, next is the Delta 767-300 over here, which is obviously going to be going to Los Angeles as flight 495. And it actually came from Seattle as flight 310 in which that flight actually goes back to Seattle with the same flight number. 
case you're not aware. And over here at the Alaska gate, we have the Alaska 77 900 EI. Uh, yeah, 77 900 EI. I don't know why I called it a 900 when it's when it's it's literally an 800, but whatever. Uh, they're going to Portland today. It's pushing back right now. Yeah. All right. Finally, we have here the Diamond Head Concourse. We'll start over here. We have the final new model. This is a custom Philippine Airlines A330-300. And this aircraft is gonna be going to Manila, obviously. That flight comes in as flight 100 and it's gonna be heading back out to Manila in a few minutes as flight 101. And this actually used to be an Aer Lingus, as you can probably tell by the back parts over here and all that and I still haven't done the engines yet um, and I did some of the winglets because yeah Philippines their winglets on the inside is white and on the outside is a different color so I don't know if I'm gonna do the engines probably soon hopefully maybe in the next update you'll see these engines be covered in white we'll see United 777-200 over here uh, this one, I think, came in from Houston, it's flight 253, and it's gonna be heading out to Denver as flight 383, so Mile High Aviation, if you are gonna be watching this video, uh, yeah, this, this plane is gonna be hanging away, my dude, so yeah, get ready. Alright, next here, Qantas A330-300 here, which is doing the Sydney flight. It's flight 103, I think. No, 104. Or, I don't know. W one of those two flights. I, I always get that one confused. So, yeah, we're, we're just gonna ignore that. <laughs> Alright, next here, the Asiana 777-200 here, which is gonna be operating as flight 231 for... Uh, or, no, it's gonna be heading to Seoul as flight 231, and it came from there earlier as flight 232. And finally, a deja vu from the last airport update. Uh, yeah, whatever. We have the a United 77-10, and this aircraft, of course, is coming from Chicago as flight 219, but this time it's gonna be operating the flight to Washington Dulles, Washington IAD, which I'm not sure if United is still doing that route to this day or if they stopped it for a little while. I'm not sure. I'm going to have to check. But yeah, this is going to be heading to Houston IAD. Or not Houston. It's going to be heading to Washington Dulles. And it came in from Chicago or here earlier. Alright guys, that's it for this update for Honolulu International Airport. If you do like these updates, then be sure to like the video, comment, any subscriber routes you want to do, we'll try work something else or something like that. We'll try work something out. Also be sure to subscribe to this channel for more model reviews and of course airport updates. I will hopefully get reviews for the Philippine Airlines A330 Custom and the EPS MD11 out soon. And also for my Lillian Mapper International Airport, my fictional airport, uh, yeah, I, I will actually try and get an update for that out. We'll see. And also for Chicago Rockford, so that because since, since I have two of these Allegiance and I have Sun Country, which actually does fly there, then yeah, I guess that will be quite interesting. A pretty short update, but it will do. But yeah, be sure to say subscribe so you don't miss out on that Chicago Rockford airport update or any other airport updates. Again, if you have an airport that you want me to try do, then do comment that down below. So yeah. And um, also, uh, this video shout out, like I said in the beginning of the video, goes out to Mile High Aviation. And if you haven't checked this channel out already, I'll link it down into the description. Really cool model of HL. 
uh, yeah, definitely better than mine, but, uh, yeah, well, hi, if you are watching this, a uh, couple things, number one, you are the shout out for this video, and also this United 777 is gonna be heading to your Denver airport, so yeah, just be ready for that. So yeah, thank you very much for watching, and I think on that note, also, hi, be sure to subscribe to Everything Points and More, which is my main channel. I do have uh, different types of reviews and also plane spotting in that and some other juicy stuff to go with that. But yeah, I'll also link that down in the description below and we'll finish off with the Philippine Airlines AC30 over here. So thank you all for watching. Be sure to subscribe to Mile High Aviation and my main channel, Everything Points and More. And I'll see you all in the next video. Goodbye.